An Asian buffet that barely passed health inspection earlier this year failed their August inspection. But the owner tells the night team's Tim Gerber he's made some major changes since then. And Tim revisits a Chinese restaurant that has had repeated problems behind their kitchen door. King's Cafe, located in the 7800 block of I-35 South, got a failing score of 68 on their August health inspection. That's three points lower than the score they got earlier this year when they were first featured on BKD. Food kept at improper temps had to be thrown out. Fly traps were found above a food prep area while a metal tray was found stacked on top of ready-to-eat meat. An employee cooking meats couldn't answer the inspector's questions about food temperatures. The interior of the ice machine had a buildup of black and yellow residue. They were told to remove all dead pests and show proof of pest control receipts. They were also told to stop using old cans to store food items. Several violations were repeats. It had been several weeks since the failed inspection, so I stopped by this week to see if the business had made any improvement. Owner Ricky Liu says he's disappointed by the low scores, pinning much of the blame on a former manager he let go. She don't care about the business, we, and we fire her, and we also and talk to the inspector Rose. Okay. She she will check it. She come back, respect it again. She say everything okay. Lou says he's hired a new manager and has taken a more hands-on role with the business. He says they're getting monthly pest control services and hopes to have a higher score at their next inspection. <laughs> Beijing Express, located in the 8,000 block of Marbach, has been featured on BKD multiple times. Most recently, this past March when they had a 70. They improved a few points up to a 76 on their August inspection. All of the food in a cold hold unit was too warm. None of the employees washed their hands during the inspection. All of the equipment needed to be clean top to bottom and the entire business was in need of a good cleaning. A side door was found left open and we also found a door wide open when we stopped by. I tried to ask some questions. This employee at the front desk said she would get a manager, but a few minutes later asked us to leave. Do you want to, will somebody talk to me about your scores? No. According to health department records, the last time the business had a score above 80 was way back in September of 2019 when they got an 82. For Behind the Kitchen Door, Tim Gerber, KSAT 12 News. Keep up to date with all of San Antonio's top news, weather, and so much more by clicking the like and subscribe buttons below. And once again, thanks for watching KSAT.